depreciation calculator professional is a comprehensive depreciation calculator it covers straight line depreciation production or unit depreciation declining balance sum of years digits and irs makers let's take a look at the straight line first we'll ignore the property class uh, um, gds ads will enter the asset value so one thousand dollars life is five years and the salvage value at the end of the life is one hundred dollars we calculate the depreciation straight line depreciation here we see total depreciation cost and percentage depreciation expense per year and then um, the ending book value as well as accumulated depreciation and this is what the ending book value looks like and accumulated depreciation expense look like now we will move on to uh, the declining balance method of depreciation will leave the asset value life and salvage value the same so we'll move on to calculating it so this is how the depreciation schedule looks like and this is how the ending book value and accumulated depreciation expense look like now we will move on to the sum of the years digits so let us see how it looks like we'll leave the asset value life and salvage value the same and so this is how the depreciation schedule looks like and this is how the ending book value and accumulated depreciation expense look like so now let us uh, focus on the production or use method so we will leave the asset value asset life and salvage value the same so we'll enter the units produced a first year 100 units we'll add it second year is 200 units third year is 300 units fourth year and fifth year say 400 units each and we are going to repeat the 400 and then we add so let's calculate so this is how the units are produced per year this is the depreciation schedule and this is how the ending book value and accumulated depreciation expense look like so now let us go to the makers method the irs method in this method we need to specify a property class uh, let us consider a We are going to consider a nuclear power plant. Uh, this calculator actually covers both the real estate property, non-residential and, and residential real estate property. In this case, Makers case, we have to select whether it's a GDS method or ADS method. We need to supply the asset uh, value, say 10 million we don't have to supply the asset life and the salvage value because based on the depreciation method it will calculate um, so it will ignore any of the remnants from the previous uh, calculation so it doesn't really uh, take that into account but we can specify the start date so we can start on month of April so now we are going to calculate the depreciation schedule so we see it is a 16 year life and um, it's a million so we are basically saying uh, specifying the dollar amounts in uh, thousands so here is how the ending book value and accumulated depreciation expense look like uh, in addition to seeing the data on the screen we can actually save that to a the SD card so that's the file name you can, all, you can also email if you want to erase the data this is how to erase the data and if you want to get uh, out of this application exit out of the application this is how to get out of, get out of the application with this i hope uh, i conveyed the understanding of how this application works thank you very much